Hello everybody, time to review on the Fantastic Four Invisible Woman figure. Um, now, I'm not sure if this figure changes color or not. I know they had another figure that did. And this figure came with, like, clear weapons. It's a clear figure, so it's kind of hard to see her. This figure breaks very, very easily. It's very frail. I used to have another figure of this, and it broke very quickly. It broke after, like, a few months. So you gotta be careful with this figure. I'm not sure why it's so frail. It could be that it's very, very thin. So it breaks very easily. I'm not really sure why. Um, it's really kind of weird, um, to say the least. I like her face. Um, I like the uh, figure as a whole, but it just breaks so easily. And I just also wish that this would change color. I'm not sure if it changes color at all. I don't, I don't really know. Um, it's a nice figure, though. It does come with some accessories, which I'm not going to show in this video. It has an action feature, I think, where you just put the weapons aside. There's no really bit lever or button. I think you just put it in water and it changes, but I'm not really sure. I, I don't want to put it in water because I think that would, that would loosen the uh, plastic and would make it break because that's how I broke it the last time. So I just want to kind of display it as it is and not really do anything with it. And this is from the Fantastic Four Toy Biz series. Um, and that's going to be my review today for the Invisible Woman um, Fantastic Four figure, which is really cool and really nice. Thank you.